I am Dr. Sharjeel and you are watching my YouTube channel. If you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe the channel at the end of this video. Now here you can see that we have applied um, pedical conjunctival plus amniotic membrane graft on the corneal perforation. This female patient had a resistant uh, keratitis with impending corneal perforation and uh, there was a serial positive as well so as a tectonic graft was not available what i decided i had amniotic membrane so first i applied amniotic membrane and then to give it support i also over the amniotic membrane i applied pedicle conjunctival flap from three o'clock and now you can see that anterior chamber is well formed and uh, the ulcer is also healed and the globe is saved so the ideally ideal thing is if you have got a spare a scleral graft or uh, uh, you have got a corneal button then you should apply that patch corneal button first then scleral button and if you don't have these things then you can apply amniotic membrane but amniotic membrane alone will not patch the defect either you have to apply conjunctiva along with it or you need partial scleral th uh, partial thickness a scleral graft that can also support the cornea and fill the defect so these are all the modalities that you can try and save the globe so here what i did i first applied two layers of amniotic membrane and then superimposed amniotic membrane by conjunctival flap and now the eye is safe thank you very much